we sat down with Warren Buffett a few weeks ago, talked about minimum wage, and I asked him if the federal minimum wage should be raised, and he said, I have been thinking about that question for 50 years, and I don't know. Uh, as a Berkshire company, do you think the federal minimum wage should be raised? Well, you know, it's a really tough question, and it really does impact our franchisees. We really do believe that people need to be paid a fair wage, and right now it varies state by state. So, you know, we are working through that issue with our operators, and there's a big issue. We hire a lot of teenage and part-time employees, especially during the summer. So we're trying to weigh what the real impact of increasing the minimum wage will truly be. Do a number of Dairy Queen employees make minimum wage, either the federal or state mandated minimum wage? Yeah, I think if you look at a lot of the part-time workers, uh, and you know, for example, in our state, we're based in Minneapolis, the minimum wage will go up yep. over several years. So yes, a lot of our part-time workers, but when you look at our managers, assistant managers in a store, our franchisees pay you know, much greater than minimum wage. But there are a number of employees that work behind the counter, for example, do make minimum wage. Uh, yes, but in many cases, uh, a lot of those employees would be part-time. So let's say that the federal minimum wage uh, is raised to 10, 10 an hour, as President Obama would like to see, if that passes. Does that impact hiring at Dairy Queen? I think it impacts hiring at really all companies. Uh, in the fast food industry, a lot of people are dealing with how many part-time and how many full-time equivalents they will have on board. But the bottom line is we have to have sufficient employees to run our businesses, and it takes a lot of time to train people. So a lot of times you want to make sure you're paying a very good wage, otherwise you have a lot of turnover. Do you believe that raising the federal minimum wage to 10, 10 an hour would mean job cuts or less hiring at Dairy Queen across the board? Well, there's been a lot of people that have speculated. Right. I'm not sure that 10, 10 on a federal basis will really get approved, but I do see a movement on a state-by-state -state basis, and right now that's what we're dealing with as a brand. Would 10, 10 uh, mean, mean job cuts or less hiring? Uh, I don't think I'm an expert enough to really be able to say that because we have to make sure that we have adequate employees for our restaurants.